Well, it doesn't get much more bold than this. Thieves are walking into Ulta beauty stores, filling up their bags with products and then walking right out of the store. Rebecca Lopez shows us why some of them are even getting away with it. It looks like one already walked in with the purse. They are bold and don't care who is around. In a matter of minutes, people are kind of just looking at them. Uh, you can see there's, there are customers walking around. Thieves are walking right into Ulta beauty stores and loading up bags of cosmetics. As you can see here, they're just reaching in and basically grabbing anything, filling up their bags, anything and everything they, they can really fit in there. Dallas police say in this video they shared with us, suspects took more than $6,000 in products from a store on Lover's Lane, and it's happening all across the state. Take a look at this video at a temple. They made off with $11,000 of stuff. And in Turlock, you can see four women stuffing their bags and then running out the door. A lot of stores have, you know, a policy where their, their employees will not uh, attempt to stop the uh, suspect walking out uh, for fear of causing harm to the employees. So they just walk right out. In most cases, they do walk out unchallenged, but at this store in South Lake, the store manager does take action. In a news release, police say an astute store manager recognizes what's happening and immediately calls 911. Another store employee locks the door to stop them. The store manager takes the bags away. The suspects have a tough time getting out, police jokingly wrote. And in the final moments of Ish, one of them starts to lose his pants as he flees. Detectives believe the products are later sold online. You can see on this website there are hundreds of items for sale at cheap prices. If uh, consumers are seeing things that a lot of times we say are too good to be true, uh, a lot of times they are. Many of the suspects haven't been arrested, but this woman was arrested by South Lake Police for 10 separate thefts, totally more than $10,000. Ulta Beauty told WFAA they're aware of what's happening and are working with police. Police say most of the cases are felonies because of the amount they are stealing. And they say all of these thefts end up costing you, the consumer. You have to pay higher prices to make up the loss. In Dallas, I'm Rebecca Lopez. Pretty brazen.